WQEMS is about the Water Quality Emergency Monitoring Service, which is supposed to be an add-on to the EMS for open surface water reserves that are used for the production of drinking water by the water utilities industry. The five pilot areas are located in Greece, Italy, Spain, Germany, Finland. According to the latest Water and Prefer Directive classification, most parts of the lake are not in good ecological condition. Loading from agriculture, peat production and industry is an ongoing problem and algal blooms occur regularly. Past research in the reservoir has shown that it is mesotrophic to eutrophic with incidence of phytoplankton blooms and pollution phenomena from nearby pipes such as the presence of oil spills. The drinking water treatment plants of the area are very challenged by rapid water quality changes or potential risk such as water turbidity generated by heavy rainfall or the presence of cyanobacteria as they can produce toxin in the water. In this tank in 2005, a huge cyanobacterial bloom was detected, causing emergency operational uh, problems in the NAR facility. And uh, also in uh, the last three years, hydrocarbon species were also detected uh, in this tank. Uh, also causing us uh, various uh, problems in the treatment process. The WQMS system will bring to life the main objective of the project that is to enable the optimization of the use of resources by gaining access to frequently acquired, wide covering and locally accurate water status information. Exploiting earth observation and non-earth observation data but also social media and crowdsourcing capabilities. The five platform services are Water quality features changes Water quality features that can be estimated through this service are Chlorophyll A, turbidity, water surface temperature, Sekai disk depth, and colored dissolved organic matter. Bloom events detection the Bloom Events Detection Service line is focused on identifying and monitoring of harmful algae blooms formed by cyanobacteria with potential of producing toxic compounds. Frequently updated information will lead to faster decision-making about the risks by HAB changes and tuning of the treatment accordingly. Extreme Events Detection The Extreme Events Service aims at identifying hydrocarbon formations or floods and muddy waters on the surface of open surface water reservoirs. The novel algorithm is specifically developed to target small-scale oil spill or flood events in inland waters. Land Water Transition Zone Change Detection The Land Water Transition Zone Changes Detection Service will perform inundation mapping at areas of interest. Detect possible changes that took place between dates or seasons and calculate the inundation regime of the land water transition zones. Alerting module. A mobile app where end users are able to post text, photo, and location of an occurring water-related issue will be developed. A social media crawler that collects public Twitter posts that refer to water-related incidents will be utilized to search for emerging instances at the water reservoir. The WQEMS system will bring to life the main objective of the project that is to enable the optimization of the use of resources by gaining access to frequently acquired wide covering locally. Accurate water service information exploiting Earth observation and on Earth observation data, but also social media and crowdsourcing capabilities.